I graduated from University of Birmingham and after the graduation, I managed to find a job in the UK and I worked there for three years. After that three years, I decided to move back to Malaysia and since then, I've been working here for more than seven years and I'm still in R&D. I'm an industrial designer working here in Malaysia, managing the innovation design team. I choose to come to ENEA sector in Malaysia because from the beginning, I saw this as an upcoming market especially in terms of industrial design. I chose the e, e industry in Malaysia because the pay is pretty decent and it also gives me a very good work-life balance. It has very flexible working hours and you can very easily manage your work, your life, your family, all that. In my spare time, I like to go for diving. I like to explore bottom of the ocean and go to the beautiful islands around the countryside and dive with the local dive masters. I try to take at least two to three vacations a year. I'm a big foodie as well. To work all that off, I also go to the gym a lot on weekdays and on the weekends, hiking, swimming, things like that. Due to my travel schedules, I do a lot of reading uh, on the flight. But most of the weekends, I, I do family outings with my family and I do enjoy it. I am personally a chemical engineer by training and I found uh, the training industry is an interesting sector. It is a very uh, a diverse field of engineering that you apply the various knowledge and you get people from very you know, uh, different disciplines uh, working together to develop a product for the, for the global market. The most satisfying part of my work is to work along with my team members. We have industrial designers, graphic designers and we do work very closely to establish a best possible product design. I really like uh, design challenges and leading edge technologies. That, that is what wakes me up in the morning and, and welcome me to the office. My satisfying you know, moment is when I see my engineers come up with the kind of solution or product for the market. And really it's creating an environment for them to be able to turn their innovative spirit to really develop the right product for the market and then you know, sell worldwide. The e, e industry in Malaysia is where all the big players are. Here is where you get to rub shoulders with the best and the brightest in the business. Um, this is where you can truly grow and be the best engineer you can be. Fresh ideas are required for us in order to be able to continue making uh, great products for our customers. So uh, I'll give you, give you an example. Some of the products that we've been able to innovate is a farming sensor network that we've deployed in East Malaysia, where we've uh, put an a embedded product in a farm, and that embedded product helps the farmer figure out what, how to water and take care of their crops. And recent college grads have had the opportunity to go travel to actually see these end users. And it's uh, a very exciting thing to be able to go actually see real customers uh, uh, using products that you've designed. Our design team in Malaysia was approached to design a very specific radio for our customers in oil and gas sector. The big controls are designed for uh, uh, thick gloves. There are a lot of intrinsic safety uh, features that have been embedded into the radio. Big keys as well as a better displays and easy accessible knobs. So these are the very important parameters and the design attributes of this particular radio came from this team in Malaysia. Uh, which was uh, involved with our end users as well as the technical teams. One of the most interesting projects that I work on is uh, a PCR machine and that machine is a very important tool for biologists to multiply and duplicate DNA and uh, the reason why that machine is very crucial to the life science industry is because that tool is used by biologists mainly to find cure for cancer and disease. In the E&E &E industry in Malaysia, we're sitting right in the middle of one of the world's exploding markets and that's Southeast Asia. It's half a billion people and it's rapidly expanding. I love a challenge and the work we do on a daily basis is extremely challenging. So to solve all these complex problems, we need bright people and here is where you meet the brightest, smartest people in the industry. The e e industry is a great uh, outlet for recent college grads. Everybody uses products that we create and um, if you want to be a part of designing the next generation of technology, um, the e, e industry is the heart and soul of that.
it gives us really great satisfaction to see the product we worked on being sold by the millions.